2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, is delighted to bring you the first stop of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Today's coverage of the FedEx St Jude Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this third round action. Luke Hilby alongside Rich Beam, and Rich, this player has been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead, they're where they want to be, but what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack because the chasing pack is filled with some big names. So they're going to have to really bear down, focus on the task at hand. They've got to sit there and keep their emotions to themselves and not get wrapped up in everybody else around them. Today's promising to be an exciting one. So let's get straight into the action. And let's see what he can do here today. Good shot there. Henny, what's the player facing here? He is right on the 150 yard marker here. Nice shot that. That should find the surface. No, it's not often you come up against Tiger, but he's really proving himself out there today. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. This looks like it's got the speed and the line. Well, that's delightful. A birdie to get the round underway. Making birdie in the first always puts you in a good frame of mood. It'll be fun to watch the round progress. He sits in first position. Here we are at the second tee. Nice birdie in the last hole for a change. First one of the day. They needed it desperately. Now, next hole, looking for more. <laughs> Nicely done. Time for the second shot here on the second hole. <laughs> Outstanding approach shot. 12 feet to the cup coming up. Looking for another birdie here. This is tracking right into the front of this cup. Well, look who's getting on a roll now. That's back-to-back -back birdies. Kind of like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. As we head now to the par five next. Out of boy, good shot. The third hole at TPC Southwind, Rich, the first of the par fives on the golf course. A lot of water in play. You need to be brave if you're going for this in two. More golf balls hit into the water at TPC Southwind than any other golf course on tour. An excellent reason why you get a little careless. That water on the right hand side is going to gobble up that second shot. Come on, get down. And this player is really going after it here, Rich. Using the big muscles to get it home in two there. Oh, how good was that? Almost an eagle. 
And now that finds him in first place. The play so far has been stellar, increasing the lead, Luke. But can they maintain it? Let's find out. And now striding onto the tee of this par three hole. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. Oh, this is on a fantastic line. Is it the right distance? This would be a great up and down. Ooh, right by the hole. Just a short putt remaining here. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Let's see what happens here at the fifth. That was wonderfully done. Opting for the three wood. All right, he's going with a little extra club, gone against the caddy here. Let's see if it was the right shout. Oh, wonderful shot and a chance for birdie at the fifth. And Henny, what are they looking at here? He's got 10 feet here. I think he likes it. Go on, get in the hole. Nice one. Fourth booty of the day. This player is putting for fun. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. Time to tee off at the sixth. Absolutely tattooed that drive. And they're playing from about 140 yards out. That one should find the surface. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. This putt is about eight feet. All right, guys. This for two birdies in a row. Super shot, that. Gotta like it. Two in a row. He's currently sitting in first place. And coming off the birdie, they'll be proud of themselves, a chance to keep it rolling. Oh, that was pummeled into submission. From around 170 yards here. Great shot into the seventh and a chance for birdie. And just about eight feet left to the hole.
a nice line. And that puck will drop, and he'll extend his lead. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Just a couple to play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. And this one might need to get down a little. Well, that's well played into birdie range here at the eighth. This one just outside seven feet to the hole. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. This one's looking good. And that will drop in for a birdie. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Setting up now on a par four. That is absolutely spot on. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? Setting up here from about 145 yards. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. This one is chewing fiber. This is one of those great ball striking displays, fairways and greens, a pleasure to watch. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. Oh, yeah, this is tracking nicely. Well, what a performance. Eight birdies on the card. Time now to make the turn for home, Rich, and uh, this is an exciting part of the championship. What are your thoughts on this performance? Well, it's been great watching this player get the best of their rival, but still a long way to go until the end of this tournament. Let's see how it shakes out. Good shot there, Vima. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Yeah, he's about 155 from this whole location. This one looks to be on a pretty good line. Oh, that's a great approach shot. Nearly doesn't get any better than that. Amazing shot. He sits in first position. Time to tee off on the 11th. <laughs> Going with the 9-iron, nine nine, I think. Woo, back there, Horsey. Oh, that's a great shot and a birdie opportunity coming up here at the 11th. That's pretty tidy. Oh, that's a ripper. No movement up or down on the leaderboard for this player.
Let's head to the 12th hole. Wonder how they will play this hole. Do they want to attack it? If so, they can extend their lead. Lovely effort, that. Oh, well played. What an opportunity to make a birdie. Looks good. And that's for birdie. Well hold. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. <laughs> uh, great shot. Time for the second shot here at the 13th. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Not bad. An opportunity for a birdie here. It's looking solid. Look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Now on the tee, fresh off a birdie. A great opportunity to build on that momentum. Looks like they've got the five wood. Yeah, good safe shot this one. That should find the surface. Outstanding shot. High quality. Henny, you've had the chance to have a look over this one? All right, down the hill here. Got to be gentle. It was on a good line. Looks like a pretty straightforward five-footer to me. This for par. And there it is. Still in the lead now after that hole. Well, let's get amongst this 15th hole. Well, that's a handy shot. And what's in front of them there, Henny? This is looking around 115 yards out. And choosing the eight iron here. 
This one looks like it'll safely make the green. Yeah, nicely played. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. Oh, you know you want to. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? And this one is for his par. And now that finds him in first place. We have a par five here. Time to take advantage. Yeah, this is a quality looking shot, this one. That should find the short stuff. Second shot here on the 16th. Seems to have chosen the three wood. And here we are with the third shot. Well, you like the look of those hands. Such soft hands. And after that performance, they'll stay right where they are in the standings. Now at the 17th hole. And Henny, what's he facing with this one? Setting up here from about 185 yards. Over 300 yards from the tee as well. Looks to be going with the six iron. A wonderful shot here at the 17th and a chance for birdie. Just 10 feet to the cup here. This for back-to-back -back birdies. It's on a great line. Look at the old hammer hands putt. Oh, I don't mind this par putt. That's a disappointing par in the end after such a terrific shot in. And after that fine display, they are holding first spot on the leaderboard with Lydia Ko trailing in second place. All right, one more hole to go. The 18.
Oh, that's a high caliber shot. And Henny, what's he looking at here? He's got, mm, I'd say, a solid 145 here. Choosing the 9 iron here. This one's going right at the pin here. That was a beauty. This one's for Birdie. Around now in the books. Good luck next time.